today with the release of Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 1, we have gotten some amazing new items, and one of the coolest ones is the Shockwave Hammer. Now, as you guys can see right here, we currently have the Shockwave Hammer in our inventory, and these are the stats that it actually has. Obviously, these things are not correct because it does deal a lot more damage than zero damage, but the Shockwave Hammer can be obtained in really one way, and that's by opening these Night Sworn chests. Sorry, I forget what their exact name is, but basically, it's these, like, golden chests. It's the ones that look like like they would give you some crazy items and it's because they do give you some crazy items now these things can be found at the citadel but also the citadel outposts so places like the anvil square also like this area right over here and then i believe that there's some over here as well you can find them at a lot of different spots around the map and when you open one it's guaranteed to either give you a shockwave hammer or it will give you the excalibur or whatever that like sword shooting item one is so you'll get one of the two now how do you use this item? I'm glad you asked that question. There are three separate ways that you can use this item. The first one is by pressing left click and you just slam down. That will deal 110 damage to opponents if they are in that slam range. So it is literally a one shot if they do not have heals. Now, you could also go ahead and right click with this thing and it will allow you to bounce. Now, we're going to get outside to do this because I want to show you guys how far you can really go with this thing. It is insane. So as you guys can see right here, all I'm going to do is go ahead and tap bounce i'm not gonna hold it quite yet all we're gonna do is go ahead and press the right click and as you guys can see right here we just literally went jumping so far like that was really cool if we go ahead and press it again then we'll do it again and all you need to do is keep chain comboing this and you will keep on bouncing now thankfully this is not infinite so if you're getting chased by somebody with one of these things they cannot chase you infinitely there is a cooldown for every single bounce but you can store up to four bounces at once now each bounce i believe has a 15 second cooldown down so in between each bounce you are going to need to make sure you wait a few seconds but we've got somebody right behind us here so all we're gonna do is go ahead and bounce away from them and screw it let's bounce back at them and then you can go ahead and end your bounce with a big slam you can combo this thing like crazy and get some really cool clips with it it's really all about how well you manage to interact with all of the things so with this guy let's go ahead and bounce towards him let's see if we can get above that ledge and i completely failed never mind but we can still try and go ahead and slam you do not need any of the charges to actually slam all you need the charges for is the bouncing so overall i would highly recommend that you guys hop in game and start testing out this item for yourselves because it is extremely fun to use and genuinely one of my favorite items that we've gotten in chapter four but for now that is this video if you guys did enjoy it then please consider leaving a like and it and subscribe to the channel as that would help me out a ton i hope you guys all have an amazing day and i will see you guys in the next one